Well everyone, uh, today we are going to be doing a double Arcane Rising box opening for Andrew uh, V and Chris S. Uh, but before we get there, uh, I did get a little package from LSS. Oh, we'll also do, you know, oh, we'll do a free pack and a patron pack and all that stuff too. I did get a little package from LSS. Uh, from James White himself, and uh, you know this channel uh, is yours. This is your channel. You you get to uh, you get to experience everything I get to experience. I can't show you one of the things in this until Saturday, uh, but that's a uh, we got a little oh neoprene in here. Yo yeah, neoprene. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. Oh, what do you think it is? Oh ho 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 ho. <laughs> Look how good it looks. Oh, I gotta turn off the light. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, okay. And let's read our little card. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look what, what's behind here. Doop, 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 doop. Saturday. Okay. 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then we are going to be streaming with DM Armada after his reveal is at 11 Eastern Standard Time. So at like 11.15 Eastern Standard Time, we'll have a live stream with me and DM Armada. We'll, we'll talk about both of our cards. We'll kind of chat with you guys in the comment section. It'll be a lot of fun. That's my card. I can see it. You can't. I can't wait to share it with you. It's pretty cool. All right, Kid the Table TCG, for those of you who, for those who seek knowledge, untold power awaits. Beyond the gates, a shattered reflection holds the key to unlocking your full potential. Embrace the shadows, and all shall tremble before your might. James White. Uh, this is the this this stuff means so much to me. I, I've got my other one from from them sitting on my uh, on my wall uh, back in. If you if you notice it in my uh, in my videos when I'm doing, it, they're all there because this does like this. You know, the playmat's cool. The card's awesome. I'm I'm incredibly honored to spoil a card for them. Uh, but honestly, like this just handwritten stuff means so much to me. Um, so thank you guys for allowing me to spoil a card. I'm incredibly honored and I can't wait to share that with you guys because this art and card were already spoiled. Uh, I, I figured I was allowed to spoil. I think it's a eclipse, right? That's, that's the card. Art. I don't know. I, I'm doing my best to keep up, but it's crazy trying to, pro I mean, think of, we might have four videos go live today. This might be one of four videos. If I can get everything done, I'm super hyped. I'm so hyped about this set. Monarch is going to be fantastic. Uh, but do you guys still care about arcane? I think you do. I think you do. I think we're going to do a case break of Arcane Rising tonight, too, if I can get everything to it. All right. Anyway, that's uh, that's ripped these open. You've had enough waiting. Uh, Andrew and, uh, and, and Chris have waited for a long time to get their stuff. Uh, we do have the free pack, the patron pack. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a good, good time. It's going to be a good, good time, everybody. Uh, spoiler season has been amazing. It's been, uh, it's, it, yeah, I saw another video I was watching. I'm not going to say who it was. Uh, another guy who, he was like, Hey, I wish they would have sent out like the mechanics before we got the cards. And I was like, that seems so boring. Like, I'm, like I don't know. Maybe I'm just like looking, begging for content, but like, I love the idea of like trying to figure stuff out. Uh, that's really fun for me. And so I love the way they're doing it. Um, and uh yeah so chris let's see what we can get you buddy i mean are we supposed to talk about about arcane rising while we do this or are we supposed to talk about monarch because like i don't really care about talking about arcane it's like what are we gonna say what do you want me to talk about you want me to talk about card prices they're all going bananas um <laughs> induction chamber rifting uh induction chamber is super uh what's the card a uh, beast within uh just completely sold out on tcg player Complete. There was like a bunch of copies for like 40 bucks. Now the rainbow foil, like the lowest one I saw was like 120. Um, Beast Within with the, the Brute spoiler, that card, ooh, Life for Life, she's just like killing him. The the Brute spoiler that just came out in uh, in uh, Rad Brad's video. Rad Brad was the 12 million subscriber that I was kind of teasing to you guys. Uh, he's a good dude. I've had some really great conversations with him. Um, and uh, I, I kind of caught wind that he was in, involved and I, I reached out to him and just had some really good conversation. He's a good guy who like plays the game uh, and is really excited about the game and legitimately like I love in his video. He's like, yeah, I just like reached out to him. I was like, hey, can I spoil a card? Uh, I love that he just like cares about the game so much. So um, it's pretty cool. Uh, and he wants to see it grow. And like, I think it's awesome. Anyway, he spoiled that that uh, mecha, the brute, the, the shadow brute. 
and it's like beast within is so good i can't wait I'm, i'll probably have already talked about that today uh i don't know when this video is Ooh, rapid fire sun kiss uh so the market is just going bananas reacting to stuff and it's funny because like we have like six cards like we have seven at this point when i'm recording this video the only spoiler i've seen on um from today which will be tomorrow is uh is rad brad's video and so it's like it's like we're all overreacting but it's like true like i mean beast within is amazing in that deck i think it is anyway i haven't like you know i haven't done anything with it i was gonna buy a couple copies but i was like i already have some so uh, i might buy one or two um i'll probably buy when they popped up uh i'll probably buy some but it's just because i want to play brute i have and i love foiling out my decks um so it you know it's just cool spell with oh, oh snap chris this is chris's box right foil command and conquer destroy all the the ranger cards that are going to get revealed here bam and we're there i mean there you go there's your money back it was well worth your wait that's fine to sleeve just too excited too excited uh yeah so like beast within like that's a card that i saw and uh i was like i need one more of these uh <laughs> i need one more of these have a foil place that uh and it's like you just knew that it was gonna skyrocket right like you just knew uh <laughs> i don't know i don't know what to say to y'all uh enchanting melody take cover uh command and conquer nice but yeah uh, the other one that was it was uh was aetherize that got kind of snatched up and that one is like <laughs> i was like I don't want to buy this. I don't, know, I don't have any. I don't have any interest in like playing magic like that. Like, I, that's not my style. Uh, I, I had like a negate deck in Magic the Gathering, and I loved that. But like the brute one is like, yeah, I do want like, you know, me. I like to foil things out. Um, so, I think I said I didn't buy any of them. I bought I bought one of them. Uh, I, what I meant to say is I didn't buy them out. I didn't want to buy them out of ever all the forty dollar ones. So uh, there, there are currently some uh, on TCG player, but that card just crazy. It's just crazy. That that uh, brute hero, and the market just reacts so fast. Like it's it's just funny to me. I love it. And we've only seen seven cards. Like that's what I love. It's like we're, we don't even know. Like maybe there's a card that's way better than Beast with it. <laughs> but like we're all like, no, no, we gotta buy him. We gotta buy life for life. Look, she is just. This is Monarch, and this is all of our wallets. Like, it's just getting destroyed. She's just killing it. Um, but the artwork, I mean, look at the look at, like, look look at the artwork. Every, they are killing it. I'm so excited. Uh, but I'm also exhausted. Like, there's so much content to make in so little time. And, like, oh, it's so funny. Like, I just want to, like, everything that comes out. Like, oh, should I do a video on it? Should I do a video? And I was like, I haven't done a box opening for, like, five days. Oh, uh, I love it. Oh, that's like our third hamstring shot. Uh, we are not doing well. We have one magician. Well, we paid for the box, so we're just good. But uh, right now, you're only paying for the box. That's all. Right now, we are uh, sitting at 100 bucks. Life for life. We're getting lots of life for life. Pour the mold. We're just like all of our regular majestics. We haven't hit any of them. Anyway, I would love to know what you think in the comment section. What's been your favorite spoiler so far? Uh, what have you purchased? Are you uh, are you specking on anything? Did you buy some uh, some aetherizes or beast withins? Um, are you specking over your collection? So like me, like I needed another beast within to uh, to hit that kind of having three foils. She's just like killing them. Where's our majestics? Uh, or are you just like no? I'm just waiting for all the monarchs. I'd love to know because I, I it's gonna eventually we're all gonna run out of money. Like, eventually, like, there's so many more spoilers. Tone with the Aether Wind. Where are the Majestics? There's going to be so many spoilers. If you just buy everything that seems good, you're not going to have any money to buy Monarch cards on release. Uh, anyway. Uh, we need some Majestics here. Okay, this art... Oh, that doesn't go there. I, I do love this artwork. I do like to stop and look at that artwork. That'd be such a cool play, man. Uh, we have three packs left. We haven't hit a regular Majestic yet, Chris. Um, yeah, I'm um, a little war. Uh oh, there we go. Arc Knight Ascendancy. There we go. There we go. Now we're gonna get like three packs in a row. Boom. Arc Knight Ascendancy. We're gonna get like two packs in a row here of, uh, of, of Majestic. 
the way this works. The, the left side of the pack, whenever I, uh, look, see? <laughs> whenever I do uh, a sealed game and I, we crack, me and Robbie, my, my buddy who's always here, uh, we do a sealed game and we crack, I always take the bottom of the left side because it's like, uh, you almost always hit a majestic in the bottom left side. It's so funny. Oh, I love it. Silver the tip and dissipation shield. That's funny. No majestics until the end. Uh, dude, you killed it, Chris. You killed it. You done good, buddy. You done good. You got you got good stuff here. Uh, no legendary though. Maybe we can hit the legendary for Andrew. Okay, let's uh, wrap this up and let's move on to Andrew's box. Uh, Chris, congratulations. Uh, I'm proud of you. Um, all right, so here's the thing with Monarch, right? It's like, are you prepared to buy singles? And what do you think? All right, uh, Andrew, you get yourself a Teclo pistol. What do you think, like, the legendaries were? Like, what are you buying a legendary cold foil at? Well, they're, oh, so the legendaries aren't even equipment. Does that matter to you? Like, I don't know, man. Like, my, like, my gut is, like, the legendary, I don't know. Like, I... I like the equipment to show off and to be on the on the deck. Like I don't love the I don't love the legendaries. Uh, okay. By the way, first off, I love it all so far. And I'm super hyped about it. I just don't know how I feel about the legendaries like as regular cards. I kind of really liked the like legendaries as equipment. It, it, but maybe also like Crucible was my favorite set and there's a lot of equipment. Blah blah blah. Uh, we'll see how that goes. I would love to see some legendary equipment though. Not that I'll be disappointed. I I am blown away by the artwork. So like, if they if they put out the artwork that they put out the other day and then just like stopped, I would be like, oh, it was all worth it. The whole thing, it was worth it because of the artwork uh, and the gameplay. I think is going to be fantastic. Uh, but my thing is like, I also really love the idea of having the equipment. Maybe we have enough equipment, right? Like maybe at this point we have enough equipment. Um, but what do you think? Like, what is a legendary? You know, what is one of those legendaries going to run? Uh, Ninth Blade and Drawn to the Dark Dimensions. Uh, what is one of those legendaries going to run? And, you know, are, what's the print of it? Like, like, so those legendaries are only... Oh, I don't know. I don't know, man. It's crazy. It's crazy sauce. It is crazy sauce right now. Oh, what? I, my question is, what are you paying for a legendary from Monarch? Are you paying 500 bucks? That's kind of my gut is, like, where it's going to open up. But is it going to be more than that? Like... If boxes are selling out at $500 each, the legendaries have to be at least 500 bucks. Um, I announced my, my patron, uh, so tomorrow, today is Tuesday. Tomorrow, George from Compete Sports has given, uh, ooh, Tome of the Aetherwind, has given my, my channel um, a code for, for box openings. Uh, sorry, a code for, um, a code for his bundle. He's got an amazing bundle. Um, he's got two bundles. One's a, a collector bundle, like a whale bundle, and one's like uh, for players, whatever. Uh, both of them have arcane first, or both of them have uh, monarch first edition. Anyway, uh, so that will go live on Wednesday um, to the channel, and then on Thursday uh, I'll have my box openings will go live to patrons uh, to, to who wants to do monarch first edition box openings. So. Um, pretty excited about that. Hope it goes well. Hope you guys are excited about that. Just a little bonus thing for patrons. It's not really part of the tiers or anything. Uh, it's just I was able to get some some more product. Maximum velocity or super. Andrew, you're uh. Well, I mean it doesn't really matter. We're not even halfway in. Maximum velocity is not the best super rare for you. So uh, that'll be happening. Super excited about that. We're doing another Discord game this week on Thursday. We'll have a Discord server game, uh, armor event, whatever. Uh, tons of fun. Uh, it's this week is just awesome. All the hype is sweet. It's just fun to chat with everybody and, and see everything. Uh, I'm just so excited about Monarch. Um, did you read the lore for? Uh, oh wait, what's that new? What's that new hero's name? Oh crap! I can't forget it right now. Oh wait, let's pull it up. Did you read the lore for the new hero that that got spoiled? It is amazing. Like the 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 whole conversation is just like. The whole, the, the whole spoiler of like her story, the backstory, it's just so good. I hope you read it. I hope you read it. I hope you get into the lore of this because I think the lore is going to be a fantastic part. I'm gonna pull it up. So I, I, cause I got it. I just got it. I can't keep track of it. I can't even track of the, the name 
of the uh, the hero that just got spoiled. That's how many a Leviathan, Le- Levia, Levia, dude. The lore story was awesome. <laughs> like it was so good. Like I love that they put so much time and effort into it. Um, and that like oh, the card just looks sweet. So brute, huh? Nobody saw that coming either. Oh, what we got? Another argument. <laughs> the duplication in Unlimited is unbelievable. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. Unlimitedly believable. Uh, so, Le- Leviathan. Nobody saw Brute coming, right? Like, everyone was specking on all these like new classes and blah, blah, blah. And nobody saw Brute coming in Life for Life. She's just, like, killing them. Um, and all of a sudden, they released a Brute. And it, like, it's super good. Like, I love how the old Brute stuff was all, like, um, like rolling and dice and kind of random and kind of like bonehead barrier kind of stupid and like she looks like a smart like she knows what's up like she definitely knows what's up uh and i think brute's going to be a class to be reckoned with um just because of like i don't know just the attention that they put to it. maybe that's just how the attention they put on all of them there's only one spoiler louie settle down louie life for life look this is me being really excited and this is any coherent conversation that we possibly could have had today uh because i'm just too excited about everything andrew i'm not very excited about your opening so far although we are on the bottom left of the box which means that everything spicy will happen right now um bottom left of the box of unlimited is spicy ah not yet it's not we're not on the bottom yet guys we're right in the middle um yeah, I don't know. It's just it's so hard to like make your evaluations on anything because it's like, what's going to happen tomorrow? What's going to happen today? Um, but it's a lot of fun. I'm really enjoying uh, my spoiler like recap and looking at the sport. Like, it's a lot of fun to like, I don't know, to check out what could be happening. Silver the tip, back alley break line. Where are the good these? This I can't complain. We got a foil command and conquer, so I have no complaints on these two boxes. But this box is poo poo. We got, dude, we got two supers. Okay, there's another super. There we go, three supers. So the next packs are gonna have a, a majestic and a super in it, almost guaranteed. Cause you, we're missing a fourth super and a second majestic. We got our foil super or majestic. We're still missing the legendary. That's uh, that's the deal of the day right now. We're still missing the legendary. Uh, I'm running out of um, product. We'll see what else we can do before Monarch. I've got a lot of uh, unlimited. Another, there's our super. Okay, so there's our four supers. <laughs> Bottom of the box, everybody. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, probably gonna do a case break on on uh, on Sunday because I wanted to keep it for Tuesday. Uh, all right, we got one pack left. Andrew, buddy, my friend. This has to be a Majestic, or your box was poo-poo. And your box was still kind of poo-poo, honestly. If it's a Legendary, it's not poo-poo, but really, I mean, you got nothing here. This is a, this is a feel, oh my gosh. That is what you call sorry, dude. That is a feel bad. I feel so bad, I'm gonna give you a pack of WTR Unlimited. I feel that bad, Andrew. Hopefully we pull you something good here. I feel that bad. That's all I got left, though. Hey, it's showtime. Okay. There you go, buddy. May the force be with you. Uh, there's something. There's another three bucks. <laughs> That's still really bad. All right, let's do um, our patron pack. Where's our, uh, our patron pack? So this is all to the first patrons that signed up. The first ten patrons. Oh, just knocked over all the comments. Here we go. Patron pack. Oh, it went off the table and didn't even roll. Here we go. Uh, 19, Tanner J. All right, buddy. Tanner, let's see what you get. And then our uh, our question of the day, what was uh, what was the uh, where was where was Levia Levia sold into? What was she and where was she sold into? Uh, Sigil of Solace, there, everybody. There you go, Tanner. Sigil of Solace. Where was Levia born? Or where was uh, Levia forced to go in the Lord? It's a really easy question. There's a, it's a, the service of what? There, there you go. That should be good enough for you. 
And then you gotta name this foil, foil zap. Not a great pack, but cool artwork at least. Hey, I hope you guys are as excited as I am about Monarch. Uh, things are going crazy. Uh, thank you so much to James White uh, and to LSS for sending me this. Of course, you guys all know, I am a sucker for play mats. I will keep making flesh and blood content literally forever if they uh, decide to send me one play mat every now and then. Actually, I don't need that. That was just a joke. I was just trying to tell you my excitement for play mats. Um, I don't need anything. I, I don't, I'm not entitled to anything. Uh, I'm just really excited to and honored to uh, to have it because I really love play mats. I think they're sweet. Um, and you guys all know that. And that's what I was trying to say. Anyway. Uh, thank you to Andrew. Uh, thank you to Chris. Thank you to James White. Not even for like this stuff, but just for creating an amazing game. Like it's so cool to me. Like I was talking to George and Mitch the other day. Just like how funny is it that like it's, like this game of cardboard is like what brings this community together. Like it's just such a funny thing. But I'm very thankful for it. So uh, thank you, James. Thank you, LSS. Thank you, all the patrons, all the viewers of the channel. Uh, I appreciate you all, and you are all amazing.